Unit 17. Metal and Non-Metals. Lesson 19. Some Gases. We have already discussed that elements are mainly grouped into two categories i.e. metal and non-metal. There is no sharp line of demarcation between metal and non-metals in the periodic table. Some elements exhibit closely to metals, whereas some exhibit the properties of non-metals. Physical Properties of Metals. Most of the metals are found in the solid state except a few like mercury and cesium. Metals are generally hard. They can produce metallic clink sound. They possess metallic luster. They can be beaten into thin plate. This property of metal is called malleability. The metals that show this property are called malleable. Metalloids. Elements that exhibit the properties of both metals and non-metals are called metalloids. Unlike metal, they are neither malleable nor ductile nor tenacious, but arsenic is good conductor of electricity and antimony forms alloys with metals. Alloys. An alloy is a homogeneous mixture of two or more metals, or a metal and a non-metal. It possesses in general the properties of metals as a class, and in particular the general properties of the elements of which it is composed, but these are not necessarily intermediated. Brass is an alloy of copper and zinc. Bronze is an alloy of copper and tin. Amalgam. The alloys of metals with mercury are called amalgams, egg. Sodium amalgam, zinc amalgam, etc. Are all of metals in animal life. Their body consists of mainly CHNOP and S elements. Besides these major elements, there are some elements which are found in less amount, but perform the important functions in our body. Zinc. Zinc is available in very less amount in our body. An healthy adult body contains 2 to 3 grams of zinc. Zinc is used by our body to make some 300 energies, and mostly zinc is available in muscles and bones of our body. Sodium and potassium ions and their importance. Sodium potassium is an essential biological element to the more advanced animals. The ratio sodium potassium concentrations in intercellular and extracellular fluids is responsible for the transport ions through the cellular membranes, the regulation of the osmotic pressure inside the cell, the transmission of nervous pulses and other electrophysiological functions. For all of sodium potassium in human body, sodium ions are primarily found inside the human cells such as nerve cells. They regulate the flow of water across the cell membranes. They are needed for transport of sugars and amino acids into cells. Mercury. Mercury is a heavy metal and is found in liquid state in room temperature. It is a toxic metal. The harmful effects or poisoning effects of mercury is called hydrogeria or mercurialism. The mercury compounds or mercury droplets are toxic to humans as they have serious impacts on nervous system, kidneys, liver, etc. It interferes the development of fetus during pregnancy. It damages the hearing, listening and speaking ability of a person. Weed. Lead is also a heavy metal which is widely used in varieties of products. It is excessively used in paints, plastic toys, etc.